Hello everybody, Logan is here, and welcome to Minecraft Survival Island. Okay, so... I'll explain really quickly. This is not all the stuff we have. We have melon and a few trees. This is actually a really generous start we got, as you can see by the SS dinghy down here. We have cake. Two villagers, which I assume is the crew. Raw salmon. And Lucky Leo. Yeah, I told I I made this <laughs> I made this starting area, so I basically gave myself everything I think I would have wanted. So I'm sorry if I was it seemed too generous to ge 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 generous to myself. In fact, I'm pretty sure I was really generous by giving myself a watermelon to start with. But anyways, enough about me complaining. I should probably get some wood, and I want to clear this area out of grass, or at least the tall kind. Actually, no, I want to clear it out of all grass, even though I just got done placing all of it. This island was lifeless when I started here, so, yeah. Break all the stuff on this top layer first. Also, I know from a previous world I made here uh, with this seed that there is coal on this island somewhere. Like, coal in plain sight, not coal hidden underground. So, it shouldn't be that hard to get a few torches going before nightfall. Okay, so that's pretty much everything cleared out on this side of the island. Yeah, there's a ton of things over here. So, yes, yeah, so we do have two villagers, so we can start an actual village if we start to get a bit too comfortable. So that way, that should hopefully keep the series going for a while longer. Probably won't, but... <laughs> Hey, who knows? Who knows? So, so uh, although it's kind of sad to say, the, the SS dinghy won't be staying with us for a long time. In fact, we kind of got food from it, so we should probably work with that food for a while, since it is basically free food. I don't know why I'm going to try to stay save wood. I probably shouldn't be, so... Yeah. I'm sorry if I don't sound very enthusiastic. It's Minecraft. It's pretty hard for me to be enthusiastic while playing it, mainly because, I don't know, I just, I mean, not in terms of PvP, PvP, but in terms of survival, I just consider myself a bit too good at the game. So, this will kind of be my test, although survival islands bore me a little bit. This will be my test. I have chosen this to be my test, and it will be my test. If I can survive here, I can survive anywhere. And by that I mean after I'm done with this, I'm going to be possibly doing another Minecraft series. So yes, this will be taking place of reassembly in the meantime, since I... If you're viewing this, I'm most likely done with the Separatist faction. Or at least I'm going to release the last video after this. Which is probably going to be what I end up doing. Oh, right. I have to make some torches. Look there, our brightness is bright, so... But our battery is low. Easy fix. No. Okay. That was a bit annoying, but... Anyways. Anyways, anyways, anyways. We have coal. So we can make some torches. Uh, 
that should be good enough for now. Not as much light as I would have liked. And we're almost out with the cake, so... In fact, I'm probably just going to want to destroy this. You know what? No. I'm going to try to make it a mission to leave the SS dinghy for as long as I can. So, if someone is a very loyal viewer, start counting down the days. Or, if you don't want to do that, because it will just be too tedious for nothing, I'll just look back on the footage to see how many days I spent here. This video will probably be 15 minutes long, yes. And this series may contain a lot of jump cuts and off-camera clips, so... That'll be fun. <laughs> That'll be just great. Uh, enough, enough sarcasm aside. Enough sarcasm aside. I am good with grammar. <laughs> uh, well, there's a furnace, but I'm not sir, sure I'm going to want to cook my stuff just yet. In fact, if I can, I'm probably going to want to fish. Okay, I thought that was a cave for a second. I was like, oh, I didn't notice you. Fishing. Something I'm going to be doing off camera, most likely. But for now, nothing's going to be off camera. <laughs> If I do something, you're gonna see me doing something. So that means long moments of awkward silence. Like fishing. And yes, I did enchant my fishing rod for the sole purpose of being able to fish much more quickly. Because <laughs> I knew I probably wasn't gonna be doing it off camera. Uh, I should have given a break in the I'm breaking this, so that means I'm gonna have to repair it somehow. Come on, fish. What's that noise? Is that a fish? Okay, what was that noise? Oh. Call me an idiot, but I never noticed you. <laughs> Crap. Um, is that new? Because to be fair, the world where I did this seat on before is quite old. So, is that new? I swear, I never noticed it before. Yeah, it's the only one. That's what we're hearing. Well, this series just got a bit more interesting. But that's probably going to be for the later episodes, considering that I've never actually tackled one of those things in survival, so this will be interesting. I'm going to wait till I get seven fish. And hence, the majority of this video's time is born. Fishing in Minecraft. It's fun. <laughs> Trust us. <laughs> and by us, I mean me and Lucky Louie over here. Yes, that is the fishing pole's name. Lucky Leo. <laughs> Oh, lucky Louie, I just... Pronounced the name that... That wrong. So I basically have to go off a move because the fishing pole is just so far out.
Are you gonna bite? Nibble? Take a nibble. Ooh. We're gonna hang you up in our wall. <laughs> in our wall, yep, we're hanging him up in our wall, people. That's what happens when you get caught by Lucky Leo. You get hung up in the wall. In the wall, mind you. Not on the wall, in the wall. It's a tight squeeze, but it'll work. Um, fish, you gonna come? I just need one more fish. I literally just need one more fish and I'll be happy. Okay, I'm getting cocky. I want one more fish. <laughs> just one more fish and I will be happy. That will scare me for a long time. Okay. That's that's all we need right there. I just need to wait for these things to cook. So in the meantime, I'll just look at this. Now, I don't think they'll swim too far away from it, if I'm correct. But I'm not always correct, so... Correct, correct, correct. I, I can't talk. I'm just trying to spruce up this island a little bit. Okay, good. You're done. We will finish up that cake, though. Hmm. Hmm. You got villagers. I forget. I keep checking the chest again. There's gonna be something else in it. That's that's probably one of my problems with chests in Minecraft. I just even if I remember placing them down, whether they spawn naturally or if I place them down, I will constantly look in them to make sure I didn't forget anything in there, even though I know exactly what the contents are. Uh. To be fair, in that one instance, I actually literally thought it was just a natural spawning chest, and I missed it, so... Yeah, call me an idiot. So we got fish, a sword with no warp. Okay, I was about to make fun of the way they spelled wood, but then I realized, oh crap, it's spelled the right way. I've been using wood, W... W O U L D more than W O O D. I forget there's two types of wood, and I was this close to saying wooden sword to make fun of it. So, yeah, I'm gonna fail a lot in this series. <laughs> Probably gonna play with a few friends. This is vanilla, so if I'm if I'm correct, my friends have nothing against vanilla. There's no land for miles, is there? I 
I really want to spawn those villagers in, but I know they'll get themselves killed and I won't be able to spawn more villagers. <laughs> So yeah, I guess that was the video. Not kind of, it, it it was dull for the first episode. It was very dull, but we did get a few important things done. We got base camp set up. I guess next episode we're gonna get our home set up. So that'll probably be a nice thing to do. So yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video, and bye.